What's up guys, Ankospangin here, and today we are playing as full AP Galio in the mid lane. And this, well, you know, is pretty standard Galio build. Uh, and by standard, if you mean standard is 1000 AP Galio, or that's what we're going for at least. The idea is that we are going for 1000 AP on this Galio mid here. Looks like we are against an Aurelian Soul, should be pretty good time. I haven't gone for an 1,000 AP build in a while, though, so I figured, hey, that sounds like fun. Why not go for it? So that's exactly what we're going to do. Now, if you don't know how to land against an Aurelian Soul, it is a very obnoxious champion to land against. All he does is he literally AFK pushes the lane at all times of the day, and there's just not much you can do about it. Boom! Unless you just are like me, and you get in his face and beat him the fuck up. So, let's go ahead and throw the Q. Boom! Oh, good flash. Oh, and he lives with 5 health. Shit. Okay. I tried to predict his flash by throwing my, uh, my winds way forward. Unfortunately, unable to do so. So. Oh, well. He's actually staying. So, either I'm getting baited by a gank. It is a jack, so it could be very, very easily happening. Or he's just staying because he's a cocky motherfucker. And, well, he's cocky. Either way, I'm cool with it. He is going to be able to take a CS lead right here. Just a very slight one. Not a big deal, though. Now, the whole idea for an a 1,000 AP build is generally you do need some Infernal Drakes. That is one of the things that is usually pretty necessary. Wow, I'm already killing those back waves. And just EQ. <laughs> Dope. I didn't think I would be able to do that already. So, boom. Boom. Walk away. I think Jax is, yeah, I think Jax is over there right now. This is about the time that if he failed to gank top, he would be here. Ooh, I don't think you should do that, my friend. Uh, he should be very careful. She doesn't have mana. I'm low. He's low. Mid laner's coming, but he doesn't have mana himself. Regardless, though, of how he looks at it, he should be careful. So we out of there. Let's actually get a Dark Seal in this lane. We can get Dark Seal and Boots. This will help our laning because Dark Seal does increase the regeneration from our potion, our corrupting potion, and whatnot. Now, the 1000 AP build, though, generally is uh, Seraph's Embrace because you get so much AP from that. Rod of Ages can give you, I believe it's 100? Is it 180? Yeah, it's 100 AP plus a lot of mana. Um, Rel Namakon usually has a place in there. You got Rabadons, obviously. Um, basically it's just a bunch of your normal AP items, the heavy AP ones, and then you just typically don't end up building Void Staff, which isn't too crippling when you just have that much raw damage. So I'm gonna go ahead and, oh, I didn't get the auto attack off fast enough. But Pain the Aurelian Soul is missing because I'm pretty sure he's going bottom right now. Lee, Lee, hit him, hit him, Lee, hit him, Lee! <laughs> okay, well, if Lee Sin hits him mid-flight, he just gets caught out. Yeah, there you go. Cool. Good, good, good. Now that he died, I just push this out and make him miss more. So, spam painting him, making sure that Lee knows he is there. And if we can push this hard enough, it should really mess this guy up. Because he's not going to be, he's not going to be in a good place after we, yeah, justice punch all four of those minions. Now he misses all these. Finally, did get a kill, but one for one, not too bad. And now Aurelian Soul here misses two waves worth of experience, or just one, because he gets back in time for these. And we'll throw that. Ooh. The damage is nice. By the way, a lot of people aren't playing Galio near as much anymore because he did get nerfed. Um, it was pretty much base stats nerf, and then they also uh, reduced, I believe, the base damage of the tornado, like the the tornado that's left over after your Q was nerfed I think and then they actually increased the AP ratio of it though so they really wanted Galio to be a mid champion for some reason I don't know why um, but I do know that they wanted that so Aurelian Soul doing exactly what Aurelian Soul does and as long as I constantly ping like I know it's annoying to watch someone ping that much but as long as I'm actually doing that then he's gonna have a hard time getting a lot off so, whoop, boom, and smack him up here. Drop the ignite. Look at that. Get out of my face, bitch. You can't handle justice. So, well, give that one smack. I might get shot. Yeah, unlucky. But use that ignite. Get that kill. 
42 to 35 CS, and we'll push out another wave. We should be able to kill this full wave before he gets back. Not going to say 100. Yeah, we totally can. Um, he's going to be able to E back to the lane, though. Which isn't really an issue. It's just an observation. So, The Q, E, and Ultimate are what scales off of AP, by the way. I think your passive does as well. Yeah, it does. I just looked. The W does not, though. It scales off of your magic resistance. If you guys didn't know that. The, uh, the W, your taunt scales off of magic resistance so it's kind of an odd one i think your ultimate also has a scaling off of magic resistance which it does um but and that's only for the damage reduction portion so remember that and as you guys can see right there boom this cosmic boop dragon pushes so quickly which isn't an issue Ugh, yes now the good thing about me being Galio and him being Aurelian Soul is if he actually goes flying out of the lane to get a gank off, I can actually just, well I can walk over to him, Oh, but I can actually just use my ultimate and follow him. Like it's going to be the easiest follow on a roam because he tries to get out of the lane and I'm just like, no, you ain't getting away from me brother, you ain't getting away from this. So whoop, get the taunt, bonk, look at that damage dude. And, oh, corrupting potion. It's not going to be enough. Fuck. Wait, hang on. Woo. Damn, dude. I thought I was going to be able to snag a cheeky one there. Just get a quick one. I mean, I could charge my uh, taunt and flash on him, but he does have exhaust. And it, should, it would do me some good to remember that. So, I just want to throw my cues out, try and zone him off the minions. We do have a pretty good lead off on him. And if you actually keep Aurelian Soul in the lane, then he really, really loses a lot of the luster as a, like a lot of his luster as a champion. And the constant onslaught of these winds of war is really hard for him to deal with right now because I am so hard for him to kill, and I don't even give a fuck. So we're gonna queue right in the middle of those, get all three of them. Jax is top. Can I get there in time to help? They don't need it. <laughs> I take it back. They don't even need my help. So throw that there. Nice, we hit him. Good shit. And it looks like it, my, or it looks like my Q is strong enough now. So we'll go ahead and interrupt that back of yours. I actually don't want him to back right now because uh, if he gets to back, then he just gets to come back to lane full health. And for obvious reasons, we don't actually want that. So I'm gonna get him nice and low here. And Bonk! <laughs> Give the boop dragon a good old boop on his snoot, as some would say. Step in here. Let's get this control ward, dude. Let's get that. I did use my flash for that kill. Completely worth it, though. 100% worth it. Now let's go back. Level up our Q again. I cannot afford the Rod of Ages. Still 300 gold off. But if I stay in lane right now, I am running the risk of dying very easily to a Jax gank. So it's better for me to just leave at the moment. I will... Eh, actually... It's going to take me a while to stack this tier, so I'm going to get that right now. And then I guess... I mean, I'll need an amplifying tone for something sometime. So I'll get that right now. But... So because the tier is going to take me a while to stack, all I'm going to be doing is spamming Qs. This will take a long time to stack, but we got to go for it. So I'm going to see. Yeah. Like I keep saying, the good news is if I know Aurelian Soul is somewhere, my ultimate's a pretty big range, and I can be pretty much wherever he is at the drop of a hat. So consider yourself hard countered, kiddo. And boom. I missed. All right, whatever. Holy damage. What is that Q damage? Boom. Dude, this Galio damage is insane. I haven't played Galio as like actual AP in such a long time. So this is really surprising damage to me. And I don't even have like that much AP. If I had a lot of AP, that would be even more insane. But I don't, so. Let's see. Huh. Ooh. Where are you going? Where are you going? For the duration of that and boom. Uh-oh. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Oh shit, I didn't hit him with the actual impact of it. Does he still die? No, if I had one more tick, he would. 
Ah, oh, fuck, dude. I thought I actually hit him with the original impact of my Q, but I didn't. I guess I should have guessed the Jax was going to be there. Really unfortunate, though. I assumed that when Aurelian Soul was over here with his stars, he must have hit the Raptor, so it went over the wall and aggroed to us. I did not think that Jax was just going to be there, so my fault. As soon as I got ganked there, I looked to see if uh, Lee Sin was in range for me to ult away, but that was not the case. I want to see if I can possibly make something happen bottom, though. Ooh, they are top. There he is. He is dying very rapidly. Jax, I don't think can 1v2 this. Unless that's a 2v2 and Lee Sin go ahead, goes ahead and... Oh, shit, dude. Was not able to get in range in time. Cannot be the hero they need. All because I died, man. All because I died. What a shitty situation. Oh, well. Oh, well. I think my ult does increase range as I level it up. Don't quote me on that. I haven't played Galio in a while, but I think it does. We'll find out. We'll find out very, very soon if it does. If it doesn't, I'm sorry, but we'll find out next level. We'll find out next level. Maybe I can get down here in time? No. They don't need me to. I do need to have eyes on the jacks, though. So I, I'm really, I really think Jax is trying to force something to happen down there. Boom! And uh, get back in here! Come on, sucker. Ooh. This is exhaust. Wait, hang on. Are you serious? Hold up. Dude, come on. Oh my god, Jax, fuck off! <laughs> god damn it! Oh my god. Oh well. Oh well. It's a shame, but what can you do? I guess as far as boots go, I can just go... <laughs> I should go Mercury Chess. I mean, your boots don't change the amount of AP you have. So, the only way that you can change the amount of AP you have with boots is by not having boots. But if I get Mercury Chess, that helps me a lot because they have a lot of CC as well as it also uh, helps the scaling on my W and my ult. So, that's some good stuff. Nice job picking up that kill. I'm actually surprised that a Jax is keeping up with farm and ganks on a, and like on a Lee Sin. That's really good, actually. So, you know, color me impressive on that one. But where's Lee Sin even been ganking? I know it ain't my lane. Wish it was my lane. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna clear this control ward here. We're gonna stop feeding. Because as Galio, one thing you do need to remember, one of the things that's kind of rough about Galio uh, as a mid laner is the fact that he is uh, very susceptible to being ganked if you're pushed up. If you are pushed up, you can get ganked so easily because people just stand next to you and you instantly can't use your E. And the next thing you know, you're boned. Now I'm going to run up here. I think Jax wants to make this gank happen, but I want it to not happen. They're not they're not fully committed, so I'm just gonna walk over here. I think Aurelian's oh never mind. Woo! Dude, bet. Bet Jax is here. Bet. And boom! Get in here! That's the Lee Sin and is it enough? I think it's I think it's gonna be enough. I think it's gonna be plenty. I'm not even gonna chase after it. He's got it under control. Good shit. Using my flash for that, completely worth it. Not a big deal. And I'll also show you guys something you can do as um, as Galio to really try and make sure your Justice Punch hits. Because Justice Punch with this windup is kind of hard. But do notice... Oh, I'm ulting in right now. Right there. Let's get this taunt going. And kaboom! Use that! Give me that! Bonk! <laughs> oh no, I've gone a little deep. Okay. Really good ult though on my part definitely right where I need to be so good good shit stopping that Jax gank from happening very well done we got the dragon as well I think if I can get in range of actually getting money from this tower yes yes that was intentional because now I can afford my route of ages so that was intentional that wasn't me trying to troll. I had to go get the local gold from the tower and also help with the wave. Now I can afford my route of ages. I pinged that just so they know that I wasn't running in just to be like a big jerk and just be like, this is my minion. 
but we got the Rowan now, and we are up to 132 AP, one-tenth of the way there. Now this scales up, how's our tier looking? 132, that's very slow. <laughs> I'm going to Q more. I guess I have a blue buff so I can just Q off cooldown. If you want to stack it faster on slower stacking champions, you can actually purchase the full Archangel Staff. It does make it stack faster, um, because it's 8 per time you like tick it up a stack instead of 4. Like right now, every time I use an ability, it goes up by 4. But every time I use an ability after I have Archangel Staff, it goes up by 8. And once you get to 750 stacks, that's the way the cookie crumbles. And let's see. Whoop. Good damage. Good, good damage. And we're just walking over here. Yeah, you guys get out of here. What are you doing? What are you doing? What do you think you're going to do, Mr. Axe Man? Mr. fucking Lumber Darius? Why did everybody come mid all of a sudden? Oh, well, whatever. I like a party. I like a party. So keep on throwing like this. One good thing that Galio does have uh, under his belt, though, that you guys can very clearly see, is my wave clear is nuts. If they are trying to do something... Oh, that damage! God damn! Give me some of that! Oh, give me some sugar! Wait, Lee Sin. You okay, buddy? Oh, shit. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Woo! I'm coming in! Alright. Oh, I hit him. Nice. Now I get an assist. Oh, she's dead. Give me all these assists. Bonk! Fuck, I tried to kill him. I tried to get him off my teammate before they got him. But, unfortunately, justice was not enough. Either way, we should be able to get this tower right now. Should be good. Should be nice and easy peasy. The test of spirit. Darius, how is your spirit? Yeah, he, he's not He's not stopping us from taking this. So this tower is gone. Good job, team, by the way. The game is pretty close, but we do have a dragon. We have five kills up, two turrets. It's it's definitely in our favor. We are definitely in the lead. I'm going to take the tower. Oh, whatever, it's worth it. I might take the tower again. So, show off that I am scary. And, okay. So, just keep it up. Oh, no. Oh, shit. That's a dead Alawi. She is not going to get dumped for the kill, but she is going to still die nonetheless. So, the prophets of the Elder Gods will not be enough to save her. Cue this. Give me all those. I am still a thousand off of my Archangels, but that's okay. Hello. So I'm gonna give me all of these. Eh. Nice, dude. The Colossus Punch gets them all. Reigns supreme. I don't have my ult here. I'm gonna award that. Ooh. Ooh. Good one. And. Oh. Beep. Look at that. Boom! <laughs> Playing this champion is so satisfying. Everything's such a massive animation. It just feels like it does so much. So let's... Maybe? Maybe? Nah, I can't get him. Nice, I got another assist. Wait, we just got so many kills? Good shit, guys. Good shit. Let's top lane looking. It's, it's, it's looking. 146 to 110. Yeah, she's winning. That's good. I'm getting very close to that... Archangel staff. Hopefully this game does have a bit of a turnaround. Not because like I want to lose, but because I, I, I don't want to win convincingly. Because if you win too convincingly, oh no, what am I going to do? There's this gigantic fucking spirit bomb flying at me. Oh, I guess I'll just have to sidestep. <laughs> but I really do want to get the thousand AP. I want to see how it feels on Galio. And I want to see how much damage the tornado does. So... That's what we're going for. I mean, you guys already know that's what we're going for. It's not like it's a secret. It's not like it's... <laughs> it's not like it's... Like, oh my god, he's going for a thousand AP. No, it's... You guys know. That's that's the theme. Get out of here, war. Get out of here. Alright, we're getting super close to this, though. How's the tier looking? 280. Since we started trying to stack it four minutes ago, we got 140 stacks. So I imagine that after I get Archangels... That will be stacked uh, around the around 30 minutes. So, ooh. Malawi goes down. Wait, wait, wait. 
I can't get over there. So if you guys don't know this, by the way, your E cannot go through walls. Your Justice Punch cannot go through walls. Do remember that, for it will save you. And boop. Oh, no. Oh, no. Get me out of there. Oh, good Q. He's taking it. My man. Wait, he didn't kill him, though? Whoa, what the hell? And save. Now, I have no idea if I actually just saved him, but I got very scared that Tristana was going to kill him. So, <laughs> better safe than sorry, they say. Now, let's get out of here. Word to your mother. I got to get my Archangel Staff. This bumps us up to 252, 307 already. This item alone is already giving me 136 AP. And that's because it gives you 3% of your maximum mana as additional ability power. And I only have 1860 AP right now. So getting, say, a Morellonomicon, right? That's effectively what? Since it gives you 400 mana and 3% of that, 10% is 40. That gives you 112 mana just instead of 100. All because of Archangel Staff. Like, the items just stack up mana so quickly. Give you so much additional damage. And it's a really good way to get to that 1,000 AP. Because it's an item that just gives so much benefit. Oh, hang on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. Hold on. Sona, come here. Hold the phone. I got your number. And... Ba-boom! <laughs> I love Demacia. It's the only place I've been. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Even if I don't get a thousand AP now, I can die happily. I can end this game happily after that one. Now let's get these minions right here too. They just die instantly, dude. How much damage does my Q already do? 439? What? That's so much. Where does my E do? Another... F Why do I do so much damage? The tornado does an additional 260 plus 6% of the maximum health over. Wow. Galio does a lot of damage. <laughs> oh shit. They're going to get cleaned. Or will they? Whoop. Ba Boom. Uh oh. Got the ignite off on you, buddy. Wait, hang on. Wait. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Red Buff. My man. My man with the plan. Ooh, she's out of there, dude. And I could try and ult the bard, but it's a lot more fun to see him go on this wild goose chase. Dude, I can't believe that was a beautiful Sona ult too. They she nailed all of our carries. Well, I, I guess I'm technically a carry. But she nailed so many people on our team, and then it just didn't matter. Like it just didn't matter at all. Because I just came in, had a four-man queue because they all got stunned and rooted there. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Please. Please. Listen, please. Yes. Thank you very much. He's going to his jungle. No, I, I just wanted to make sure that he was not trying to take this. Because if he takes this, that's so much money. Oh, <laughs> What a good amount of money. 192 CS, too. We can still do this. We can still do this. Bus bluge. Also, do remember that I think your E only knocks up one person. Like, it, it only knocks up, only hits. It's limited to one person no matter what. Uh, oh, hello. And... Beep. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? Wait, can... Goodness, that red smite really does a lot, doesn't it? I'll be honest, I really thought I could handle him. So that's what he's thinking. I see. I guess I could finish this. That bumps me to 414. Hmm. Medjai's could be good too, because Medjai's is a lot of AP as well. And this gives mana as well. Hmm. So I could get a Medjai's, and at 25 stacks, that's what? 
145 AP plus 200 mana. Morello Namacon is 112, like we talked about. And then I'll get Rabadons and Ludens, probably. Unless there's a better item that I can think of after. But for now, we'll just get the Morello Namacon. Yeah, we'll just get the Morello Namacon for now. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Alawi just fucking... Mm. She laid it down. She laid down the law, dude. She's showing that people should not enjoy the squid as much as they do. She's showing why they make videos of those. But don't worry, it's it's art. Don't let anyone tell you differently. It's it's art. 419 AP. I need Rabadons at least, so I can get at least into like the 700s, right? But that damage is gnarls Barkley. Can I, can I smash him with another one? Alright. Ooh. Come on. Come on, Sona. Do it again. Oh, Sona. Oh, Sona. Walk this way. Come on. What are you... Stop. Stop going that way. Come back this way. Yes. 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 Yes! <laughs> Holy shit, dude! That damage is so good! Holy fuck! The Q does so much. Like, if I can hold them in my burst, the squishies stand no chance. Oh no. Oh, he barely missed it. How much does this do? 391. Not too bad, though. Not too too bad though. Alright, hold on. Do I do I go for this haunt or do I play more like a feel? And ba boom! And uh, get me in the air! Oh! Suck my dong. Oh well. Wait, do they still? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. God damn. You know. The risk I took there was calculated, but I must be really bad at math because I did not calculate myself dying. I calculated an ace, but I did not calculate myself dying. We can't end. I don't have a... No! <laughs> hmm. Well, we still had a really good time regardless. The damage is fucking bonkers. I just smooblied all over them. Uh, let's see, who do I want? I wish I could honor more than one person, but they were. My team was very supportive of my decisions, and I enjoyed them greatly for that. But seven, four, and thirteen, AP Galio is still legit, boys. Some people think it might not be, but I say it's legit. Just look, take a take a peek. Just just eyeball emoji that there for a second. Take a peek. Look at the damage. It cannot lie. The damage graph cannot lie. So, beautiful stuff. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Definitely do not be discouraged from playing Galio. I know a lot of people that really love Galio were afraid to play him anymore um, because they're like, I can't play my top lane tank anymore. But just, just play him AP mid. The actual build is like Rod of Ages into Iceborne Gauntlet into more tanky AP stuff like Abyssal Mask, or you can get, you know, Rylize is very good, Rylize Landry's, all that stuff is really good. Uh, Banshee's very strong on him, obviously, AP and the MR and the Shield. You just build him like a tanky AP and play him mid. Huge roam potential with your ultimate, huge gank potential with that, and also, as you guys see, a staggering amount of damage. And, well, we didn't get the 1,000 AP, game was too short, but we were well en route to get it, so... Maybe next time we'll try our best. Regardless, if you guys did enjoy this video, though, do make sure you leave a like and a comment. It really does help me out. I just bit my tongue really hard. Please, please, that really hurt. If you want to, you can follow... Uh, God, now I can't even think. You can join my public Discord or follow me on Facebook, Twitter, or Twitch. All four links will be in the description below. And as always, I love you guys. I hope you have a wonderful day. Peace!